Hi everyone, it's Chris here from Retro Consoles UK. So I got a package in the post today and I was thinking I can't remember anything that I've ordered but I opened it up to see it's my physical copy of Streets of Rage 4 for the PlayStation. So I ordered this from Limited Run Games so I was super happy when it arrived. So we'll go through everything that came in the parcel. So also as well, so to my surprise there was other items in there as well. So there was official soundtrack made by Limited Run Games. So it has on the front there and it has all the songs on the back, which is super cool. I also got a newsletter from them about up and coming games they're going to release and interviews and stuff. And it also came with a really cool card as well, Limited Run on the back. So I thought that was really cool. I was really happy about the extra things. So the case itself is really nice, really well designed. It's got the main graphic of the game on the front there. The spine itself, it's got the Streets of Rage 4 logo and obviously PlayStation 4 logo on there. Um, on the back, it's got a little bit of information about the game. It's got some images from the game as well. It's got the limited wrong game number there, which is 332. It's also got the standard kind of information you get on the back of all the PlayStation games. So we open it up and you've got the disc there. So the graphic is really nice that they've done on the disc. So obviously they've got the original Streets of Rage logo there with Streets of Rage 4. They've got all the characters down there as well. And if you take the disc out, you'll be able to see on the back there is inverted insert sleeve, which is for bare knuckle 4, which is obviously what it's called in Japan. There's also a very nice manual as well. So that's a really nice touch. They went to the trouble to make a manual. So it has a little bit of the story inside, the controls, the heroes, the enemies, like you get in a classic video games manual. So what all the buttons do, and it tells you about the main characters that are in the game and gives you a bit of their background like old video games used to do. So these are all the main characters. So a couple of them are from classic Streets of Rage games and some of the characters are new. You'll recognize him as a bad guy. It's a very classic Streets of Rage bad guy, along with Big Ben as well. And even Raven is a classic, very classic style Streets of Rage bad guy. So it covers all the characters there. And in the back it does a bit of... They talk about the three developers that made the game, what inspired them, what other games they've made. So really nice, really well put together manual. Um, I know a lot of the fans were of classic video games will really appreciate the manual that goes with it. Um, so these are the three companies that made the game. So um, one of the companies also made Wonder Boy um, a couple of years ago as well. So that's really nice. They've gone through a lot of effort. They've, the graphic is really nice on the disc. It's not a sticker on there. It's been printed on there. It's really nice. The colours are great. Um, and I can't wait to add this to my collection. So I held out and held out when the game got released uh, about three months ago. You could have downloaded a physical, you could have downloaded a copy and played the game, but I didn't, I wanted to wait till I got the physical release. Um, I had to wait three months and shipped all the way from America. So I'm super excited to play it. So let me know what you think. Have you played, have you downloaded the game? Have you played it? Did you order a physical copy as well? Let me know what you got, because I know there was a few different packs. There was a few bigger ones. Uh, I'm super stoked with the, the CD as well to add to my collection. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next time.